What's up guys, Heakin here bringing you a live reaction to this week's Marvel's The Falcon and the Winter Soldier, Episode 3, The Power Broker, apparently that's what it's called. So yeah, I was doing reviews for this and I didn't do the one for Episode 2 and I just thought, screw it, let me do a reaction video to this. After doing uh, Godzilla vs Kong, I just thought, why not just do it like this? There's a lot of people who do reactions like this without having the footage there, and I obviously I can't do the footage. I can't do it because it's it's hard to get it, and it's long. Okay, mostly it's long. It's like an hour, and I and I can't sit there but here and edit an hour long piece of footage just to. You know what I mean it's that's impossible for someone like me to do. I don't have the time or money for that kind of shit, so that's just too much, too much. Plus, with the low quality technology I have at home, so. You know, i got to make do with what i got. So this is the best way to do it, in my opinion. Just just react to the episode. Watch along with me. Sometimes I'll react. Sometimes I won't. It's a case of... Because I like to be quiet when I watch things. Do you know what I mean? I don't like to like make... Oh, my God. Oh, sometimes that'll happen. But most of the time, I like to sit there quiet and, and see what I'm watching and think about it. But if something cool happens, I will be like, oh, shit. Like, do you know what I mean? I'll, I'll act like that. But, yeah. Let's see how this, let's just see how it goes. I mean, for the most part, my, my Godzilla vs. Kong one went sort of well, but I was just sort of more of an experiment. Let's see if this experiment will work, because I kind of do want to do reactions like this a lot more. Like, I want to do anime reactions like this. Instead of having the footage then, you guys can just, I can just post the whole thing and you guys can just watch along with me. Do you know what I mean? Like, it's it's better that way, in my opinion. In my, in my opinion. But we'll, we'll see. We'll see how it goes. So here we go then. Um... Trying to synchronize with me. Wow, 50 minutes long. Jesus. Okay. Starting. Is this is this not going to go away? Is that all? Is that all going to be at the bottom now? Like, what's going on? There we go. Starting now. Previously on. Did I mention, I forgot to mention in my first review, the soundtrack they're using, like, is it Harry Jackson's soundtrack, right? Hmm. <laughs> That's sad. Hmm. That's going to turn out so well for them, isn't it? I hope I don't get copyright for that. <laughs> GRC. And the flag smashers have a problem with that. That's crazy, man. Oh, straight. This guy's doing such a good job, by the way, in the role. Kurt Russell's son, man. He's got the chops. Munich, Germany. Who? Oh.
Ja. Um Menschengeburt? Er weiß du. Sag es ihm. Oh. Steven would have done that if he spat in him. But this guy, this guy is very aggressive. Berlin. Oh man, they're in the same country as well. Jesus. Oh, I'll be looking forward to Zemo, man. What? Yeah. Technically speaking, you I mean your history was like 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 a few minutes, like a few days, like it wasn't. I bet Z was going to try using the mind bullshit on him, like, to control him, and it's not going to work. Oh, God. It's like Hannibal Lecter. The theme. I love the theme. Zemo's theme's back. Yeah. I thought he was going to try it. Okay. Yeah. That's what I liked about Zemo, like. <clears throat> Hydra's still around? They're always around, though. I'm <coughs> sorry, what? No, oh, coincidence. Ironic. That's what I like about Zemo. He was a very psychological villain. Yeah, he has a code. That's again. I read a good theory that the power broker might end up being revealed as a Zaya, like he's trying to get revenge, but we'll see if that twist will happen or not. Machiavelli. He will kill you tonight. Kill him first. What an asshole! Jesus! Oh. 
Oh, Zemo's being physical as hell, man. That's cool. Oh, he's wearing the guard's uniform. I didn't even... Yeah. You need to have... You need... You need... Yeah. You need to have people stop wearing uh, hats or something to cover their faces. Oh, that was that was good. The basement of the prison. <laughs> yeah. I'm loving this. This is what we're waiting for. Oh. The Falcon and the Winter Soda. Imagine if it said and Zemo. That would have been funny. <laughs> oh. Oh, he worked for Hydra. Oh. oh, no, no, he haunted the people that hired to recruit. Okay. Oh, he's Baron Zemo Mask! Ah. Uh. I'm hoping we learn a lot more about him as a... Ah! Welcome, Jensen. That is so awesome. Just like that. Like, oh, friend. Oh, my God. Just like that, we get that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He was, he was always a Baron. He was always a Baron, boy. <laughs> That's awesome. He's not just a colonel. If it doesn't pass the small time. And he's wearing all purple and shit. I love it. I hope we learn more about his family. Oh.
Uh, that's ironic. This is a new. This is a new thing from the comics, right? You're gonna have to become the Winter Soldier. Maybe, maybe this is Bucky embracing that persona by the end of the series, but like a good version of. Do you mean like a, in doing it in a positive way? Let is that Latvia? Did that say Latvia? Maybe I read that wrong, and that's an actual country. But is that not is that not Doctor Doom's place? Did I read that wrong? I read that wrong, right? Guys, I read I read that wrong, right? This episode's so freaking good so far, man. Like, oh my god. This is her mother who Here we go. This was exclusive to X Men, wasn't it? And now they can use it. So, Ma Madri Madri Look at this shot, man. Like just the three of them. Is that, is that an actual character from the comics, maybe? Yeah. I'm I'm kind of hoping Zemo will sort of be like an anti-hero, anti-villain in this. Like, like he won't be like, for not bad. I just hope he doesn't die by the end of this. Like, I want to see Thunderbolts, man. Look at this shit. Escorts and crap. Like, what the hell? Are they about to get robbed or something? Like, or... Does that dude have a rocket launcher behind him? What is that? Or is that fireworks? You're a season shit. What is that print the Prince Princess Bar? Power Broker is watching. Oh, the Power Broker is here. Okay, interesting. I was wondering how that was gonna tie in. Ready to comply. Winter soldier. <laughs> it's funny. Are these people not aware, like, like that Zemo's broken out of jail or something? Ugh! 
What the hell? That's disgusting. <laughs> Z was just taking a piss. What? Won't do that, you dumbass. Oh, why is that? So, so he knows him. So this went to Soldra. Oh, and they're recording it. The feet. Is Shelby the power broker or someone else? That was such a good, that was such a cool moment with the, with the, with the theme coming back. Everyone's getting their themes back this episode. Mm -hmm. I love that, like he's a parent. Who's this? You know, she knows. Oh, she doesn't. Oh. Wow, well, yeah, he gave the serum to us. system
Oh! Captain America? No. Oh. What's what's his name? Shall we dead? Or a... Oh crap. Where's Zemo? Did he just run away from them? He went the other way. Who's that? Oh, it's Sharon Carter. Yeah, it's Sharon. Holy shit. No oh, man, so also like we're getting, oh, so our main characters are now together basically. So did she shoot Shelby then? She was the one who killed her to save them, or I'm assuming so. Hosting clients. That's sad. Yep. Yeah. Is that an anagram maybe? No. No. Yeah, obviously. And the power broker gave the serum to them and they escaped. You can't even get a loan from the bank. Like, I'm not being mean, but. And he's rich, maybe he can do it. I don't know. Oh man, there's like 20, 22 minutes left. Damn. This is a good long episode. I'm loving this vibe, dude. Like, damn, so much happening. Look at Zemo just chilling there, like it's crazy.
<laughs> He's just dancing like... You found the doctor already. That quick, like... Wow, that's a... Of course they're going to be hiding in the dockyards. This is from the trailers. He's going to wear the mask here. Did Sharon betray them? Is it invisible? Is there a secret comp compartment? It's cold. A genetics lab behind there. I'm just yeah. I'm just trying to guess a lot of shit, man. Like <laughs> a secret lab. Yeah. It's going upstairs. You'd think it would go downstairs. Considering it's like a shipping container, like. Oh my god. There has to be some sort of defect to this, man. It can't be perfect, right? Zemo's gonna kill him. Zemo's gonna fucking kill him. I can just see it. Is he? It's either gonna be Bucky or Zemo. He's not gonna make offers with these guys. He's gonna straight up kill these guys, like just to just to get rid of the. There we go. Get a Sharon kicking ass with that baton. Just smack it in the face. There you go. There you go. Every bounty on her. Oh, oh, that's brutal. Shit. Come on, Sharon. Don't, don't get your ass beaten so easily. Come on. Come on. Oh. There you go. Choke that bitch. Snap that arm. So, but they won't fail. They were killed. Isaiah. Zemo's gonna murder. Zemo's gonna kill him. Like, he just. Twenty. Twenty. Don't 
Tony and Madani. You're gonna shoot him. I told you he's gonna shoot him like Oh, oh You're a shield, buddy. Oh man, Sharon's getting battered. And she's still holding her own. What had to be done? Try to get out of here, it's all boiling. Oh, Zemo's getting out. Oh man, shit just went completely sideways. It's also cool to see Sam fighting normally without the wings. There we go. Zemo saving them. He's saving them at least. Do you know what I mean? Like. He's helping them. He's got his own code. I like that. I like that. He's not he's not being like a full on Oh Oh yes. Hello what? What do you see? Yeah. No, no, you can't just leave like that. I mean, they said it. I can't believe Zemo is still sticking with them. I thought he was going to escape and do his own thing, but. How many minutes left? Oh my god, this episode's still going. Mm. 
Mm. Like Mama Donna. So that woman raised them, maybe? They were orphans? That's sad. That's sad. So they, they they had a place, everyone came back and they they were forced to move out. Understandable, but Interesting. Oh, man. Is Zemo going to go and kill him? He's making food for them. Oh, I don't trust it. Is he? The thing is, he didn't have to save them. That's the thing. Like, he didn't have to come with the car and save them, so... Okay. Shit's getting real. So is... Right. She gonna blow this place up with them inside, or What an evil bitch! It's way too extreme. Riga Latvia.
But they they weren't in Sokovia though. They had no they had nothing to do with that. Why would they visit the What's he doing? What is that? Walker, maybe, or Sharon Carter, maybe? Is she following them? Whatever. Specifically laid out for Bucky. Are they going to capture him to get his winter soldier blood? The episode's called The Power Broker, and we haven't seen The Power Broker yet. Is it Isaiah? I'm think. No. Oh! I'm here for Zemo. Right. Oh! That was unexpected. Uh, Wakanda appearance. Okay. Interesting they didn't bring any of the uh, the main characters that we know back. I got a weird feeling it like ah uh, I feel sad now. I got a weird feeling if 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 Chadwick hadn't died, he might he might have cameoed in this maybe. Only shame, man. Um, let me see if there's an end credit scene. No, that was it. That's the end of the episode. Okay, that was a cool, fun episode. That was ah, that's the best episode of the of the, of the of the of the series so far. Like the interactions with Zemo were great. Sharon Carter finally appeared. Action was sweet, but mostly the interactions. I just love the interactions and 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 the, and the theme songs and the and the soundtrack that they use. Like, and I love what they did with his character. Like, he's a Baron, awesome, and he's helping them. That's uh, unexpected. I honestly thought he was gonna take that moment to escape, but no, he's helping. Them. he's with them like and i like that i like my villains when they have like when they're sympathetic and they have a they have a cold and he's sticking to that cold right like he's doing his own thing yeah that he killed that guy it was obvious he was going to kill him you know and that's you know they understand the characters they understand the characters the writers knew like if, if zemo meets a dude like that he's going to kill him he's not going to let him live and walk out of here alive do you know what I mean so it just makes sense for him to be the one to shoot him and kill him so yeah that, that's that's in character with what we know about him so far so that was great man the the reveals were great like uh i'm not i'm honestly not feeling the kylie character like um obviously she's 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 the main villain the flag smashers are obviously the main villains in this but i'm just i'm not feeling it i i get it, but at the same time like you're just like you're spoiled you're brats basically like that's that's how I feel. Maybe, maybe they'll do a better job next next episode. Maybe when we get more character development. But uh, at the moment, I'm just like I feel like they're the weakest part of, of the series of the series so far. Like they're just sort of there. I'm I'm curious what's gonna happen with Walker. Like I feel like I feel like he's gonna get one of those serums and he's gonna become a super soldier. But like he's gonna take that dark route. Like he's gonna go down that dark path. So he's definitely gonna become like a very bad Captain America essentially because we know we know by uh, we know Sam gets the shield by the end of the series we know that I'm, I'm assuming that the lot that stuff we've seen in the trailers of him trading with the shield is is probably stuff that happens at the very end like probably the last thing we see in the series like and then and it ends but yeah I'm curious where this is going man like I did not expect Zemo to be helping them and sticking with them as, as long as he did. Like, I honestly thought he was going to double-cross them. So what they've done so far with his character is so unexpected and so freaking cool at the same time. So yeah, like... And I'm wondering if that scene... What scene is it? Is it Bucky pointing a gun at Zemo, maybe? Or maybe maybe that's like the final scene and, and, and Bucky lets him go, perhaps. Like, like that's what happens at the end, like... Like, like some sort of confrontation happens and he just lets him go like oh we're, we're in the mask was awesome like i'm hoping they explain that i'm hoping they explain more about his backstory i'm hoping you get more on his on his family and that like like how he feels and that obviously but yeah awesome episode awesome episode i loved it uh as always guys like and subscribe whatever and i shall see you when i shall see you take care and bye